What is my favorite Node.js framework? All right, guys. So it's your boy Joe back at it again. Codingface.com. Your boy's back, and I done did it again. We're doing another great video for you guys, and we're gonna talk about what is my favorite Node.js framework. So I've done a, a whole bunch of different frameworks, and to be honest with you guys, the ones that I like the most are probably Meteor and Adonis JS. I choose Adonis JS as my favorite one, and it's because I like the structure. You know, I come from the world of Ruby on Rails, Laravel, and when I'm working with Node.js, I like to have a structure where I already have everything that I need to build an application. I don't want to sit there and think about, wait, should I use this library? Should I use this other library? Should I go and play around with this other library? Should I try to do it this other way? Should I try to just go and do everything functional programming? Should I try to do this this other way? I'm like, no, I don't want to deal with all of these options, right? Because I care more about the project instead of me focusing on what library should I use? Like, it's gonna save me 0.2 milliseconds. Like, I don't care about that. I care about creating a project, creating a product, putting it online, launching it, see how users interact, finding the bugs, fixing it, and that's it. That's all I really care about. And I feel like Adonis JS gives me everything that Laravel has already. I mean, the basics. I mean, Adonis JS is not as big as Laravel. It doesn't have a huge community like Laravel or Ruby on Rails, but at the same time, it gives me all the tools that I need. And then whatever I don't get from them, right, from Adonis JS, I could literally go in and then now I get to decide, okay, cool, let me do it this way. Let me find this library for it. But the basics of it, as far as, you know, routing system, as far as like which database I should use, like I'm gonna use MySQL, working with WebSockets, it already offers me everything. User authentication, you know, like two or three different ways of doing user authentication. I could choose whichever one I wanna do. You know, I could do tokens, I could do uh, session based. Like all of those options are there. So I could go in, spin up an application quick, and then just start building, right? For me, as a developer, somebody who cares about the product, I'm not, I don't focus, I don't fixate myself into, man, how can we make this thing even faster than fast? Like, I, I don't care about that, right? You know, like, I'll be honest, I just don't care about that. What I care about is creating the products and then from there, if the product becomes huge, then we scale it. Then we go and use something else. Then we use Crystal Lang, then we use uh, Elixir, then we use Golang, whatever it is, Hasco, like, then from there we just scale, okay? Like, I don't care. I'm not focused on, on one thing, but I do care about productivity in the beginning when you're building an application or building an idea because you want to be able to build this quick. You know, if I come up with an idea today, right, let's say I come up with a social network that nobody else has, you know, if I don't build it, and try to get it out there within a month, somebody else could get the same idea and build it before me, right? Or I could come in and do something that I feel is gonna change the world and some kid in China just came up with something that is exactly what I was doing, but he did it first, right? So I'm always trying to beat the clock when it comes to that, right? So I'd rather just focus on an application, a framework that gives me everything that I need, okay? So yeah, man. That's my favorite framework, guys. You already know, it's your boy Joe, back at it again, codingface.com. Your boy is back and I done did it again. Leave a comment below, guys. Let me know what you guys think. Subscribe. I'm always gonna come here and drop some cool content and we just gonna have a cool conversation. And also check out the description below. Let me know what you think. So yeah, man, I'll see you guys later. Peace.